Well, I finally got back to it, and um, after watching all the videos of people running their lawnmowers and engines on the gas vapor, they say, um, well, I did this new test. Actually, what it, what's going on is, and I'm pretty sure you know it, or should know it, but all it's doing is when you're agitating the gas over here, it's pulling a lot of fine droplets of gas and it goes right into the carburetor just like it normally would anyhow so um, I did have my S10 hooked up I had a, uh, a line that went from the vent in the gas tank to uh, the PVC back in the intake with a valve and I could unplug the injectors and it did idle rough on the vapor and uh, I'm not going to say it's not going to run on vapor but what I did on this test is it runs fine without this in the, in the line. All that gas there was being pulled from here, and then it drops in. And I'm trying to keep it as dry as possible, and it will not run. And there's plenty of gas vapor in there. And this is about, uh, I guess, that sight level. Where's it at here? Right about there. There's gas in this um, agitator, I call it and it will not start. I even go over here and choke it some more. Don't even try. So that's the test. I don't see it running on just vapor only. It did work really well with the transducers and um, me and Daryl are going to be working on something else that goes in the line. It's kind of a hydrogen system, but not a fuel cell per se. So, um, well, keep on playing around, but just wanted to show you that. It won't start. Take care. Bye.